Hello everyone, we are back today with a brand new pedal, an updated version of the full tone Plimsoll. Now, so now we have the Plimsoll Mark II and it boasts a few improvements compared to the original one. They've changed the input impedance to you know, better interact with your guitar volume, the stock mounted jacks, and now the soft clipping and hard clipping section can work independently as opposed to the older version. Now there's a lossless bass switch so you can really tighten up things when we are going through the hard clipping mode which we will demo in a bit. And also now the treble knob has way more treble on it so you can dial in a much more brighter, crunchier tone with that. So so we're going to check out the pedal right now. I have my Kiesel Zeus going into the Plimsoll Mark II, going into a Hughes and Kettner Tube Master Deluxe 20, going into an orange PPC 2 by 12 vertical cabinet being mic'd up by a SE Electronics V7X. And here is my clean tone. I'm currently on the in-between position. So now I'm going to Turn off the hard clipping mode so it's all the way counterclockwise. I have the soft clip at 9 o'clock, the bass switch in the middle, so half, and treble at the center. And this is how that sounds. So I'm going to crank the gain on the soft clip mode a bit more. And next I'm going to show you how the bass switch works. So this is at half. And at max. And at minimum. Next, the treble knob. Now let's start bumping up the gain on the soft clip mode.
So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start introducing the hard clipping mode. So I'm going to put the soft clip at about 9 o'clock right now and start to turn up the hard clipping mode. I snapped a string. <laughs> so we're back after the string change and uh, we were exploring the hard clipping mode. So here we are. Now if I start cranking up the soft clip mode as well, you're going to hear the pedal really start to saturate. So now this is where that bass switch will really help to tighten things up if you put it on the minimum position. Because if I have it at max, So it depends if you'd like a bit of that sag or else you can just flick it to minimum and really tighten things up. And it still cleans up very nicely with your volume knob on the guitar. So let us know what you think about the tones achieved here today. Leave a comment down below. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe for more content and see you real soon.